I read an interesting interview two days ago where um, Autumn was saying that in the last four years he hadn't seen on Buhari. Yeah. And that uh, people had gotten between them and uh, he's done a lot in, in Benway and people... They, is, what is interesting about it is um, why would Buhari ignore Autumn for four years? In his place, another leader will go out of his way and say, to, I want uh, Governor Benway, please let's talk. Not just ignore him. Okay. Are you sure what you're doing is the right thing? Okay. Isn't there an option? Mm. Shouldn't we talk? Shouldn't he look for the kind of people who would listen to him? Instead of... Uh, yes, instead of simply treating him as if he doesn't exist and instead of say, seeing him as a nuisance. Then he becomes an even bigger problem. Yeah. Because this but what that's people exactly are what appears to have happened. That. He thinks nothing will touch him. He people, his people support him. He has made Benway a no-go area for Fulani. And everybody is clapping. But for goodness sake, eight years is nothing in the life of a nation. He's, yeah. go, he's going to run his term, and we haven't solved this problem. What just happened on the border is real. And it can't continue to happen. It cannot continue to happen. Because Fulani has shown over and over and over again that they can revenge some of these things. Sometimes in a very crude way. Nobody encourages this. We're yeah. not happy about this.